Hey, yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we got some good news, uh, some not so good news, but you know, starting off with the not some good news, uh, I had to blur out the leaks on my last video talking about the Transformer leaks for Transformers Rise. Um, and I, the original video I had linked down below is gone, and that's what kind of leads into the good news. Um, we have right here. Uh, I'll put up a tweet on the screen from his Transformers Rise of the Beast trailer out. Uh, thank you again. I'll have the link down below for the Twitter account. Hasbro is DMCAing leaks, which means the leaks are real. Both cutscenes are real. If you're able to watch the videos that I had linked down below or you saw that channel, the leaks are freaking real, man. And that is just so good to know that this game is actually real. I... When I was making the video, I thought the game might be, you know, real or not real as canned, but nah, man, if they're DMCAing leaks, this means the game's real, which is awesome. Hopefully, we get some information soon on the game. I know we have the Game Awards coming up. There might be a good chance the game might get revealed or a teaser. It is the Game Awards, um, but I don't think we're going to get this game at all, I think at least in 2023 i think this game's going to come out in 2024 i could be wrong i know with like follow cybertron they revealed like the first teaser trailer of it uh back in 2011 i believe like december so that could happen here with uh transformers rise but with how modern gaming is now i don't know if that's very likely but considering we already have cutscenes for the game it could happen so i would say keep an eye out for the game awards and might just watch it and see if anything is revealed um but yeah this is huge and uh thank you guys for telling me that uh that is steve blum voice of starscream which is awesome i love steve blum uh, he's such a great vo voice actor and the cm voicing starscream again like he did in transformers prime is freaking awesome um yeah man really really exciting times for uh the transformers franchise i feel like uh Everything's kind of starting to piece back together. Hopefully this game is good. Hopefully it's not in, you know, development hell. We also have some more news. You know, I forgot to cover this in the last video. The game is going to be similar to Warframe and Destiny. It's going to be a third person looter and shooter, which I'm happy with. We haven't had a third person shooter Transformers game since Devastation. Um, and realistically, Fall of Cybertron, Devastation was a single player game. Um, and this is going to be mainly multiplayer focused, which is awesome i still don't know how it's gonna work hopefully it has the customization system that we have and you know fall of cybertron and how we can make our own robots but if not if it's kind of like you know we we play certain characters i'm okay with that as well the fact that we're just getting a transformers game it just feels so unreal but it's happening if hasbro's taking down leaks if hasbro's dmcaing stuff it's real they don't want this getting out there but it got out there and I'm very happy to see what the future of this game is. And again, I, I'm excited, but I want to tell you guys, you guys should manage your expectations with games like Fallout 76 and Halo Infinite. Let's not have our expectations super high because of how those games launched and how they were in the whole live service model. So yeah, hopefully we get some more info soon. But again, let's hold our expectations. You can be excited, but don't expect this game to be... You know crazy good i hope it's crazy good but what the games like i mentioned um they both launch very poorly and that's just the thing with modern gaming but uh yeah let me raise your thoughts are you guys excited are you guys even more excited now that you know they're taking it down let me know uh leave a like if you're new and subscribe if you guys like halo and transformers content and i'll catch you guys in the next one all right later